my name is Grace and today I am going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is <coughs> Sorry. From enemy to friend, Paul meets Jesus. Let's read. Saul was a religious man. A priest is he thought that anyone who believed in Jesus was speeding a lie and shall should be put in prison and even put to death. Saul was a religion man religion hated Jesus <coughs> and he also they were and also like didn't like Jesus but so priest didn't religious leaders didn't think Jesus is alive and Jesus is the bad pe person because <coughs> like they thought that Jesus was lying but so he thought and he should he thought that they should be put in prison or even put to death. So is going to um pet in the prison. You just wanted his you just disciples. was going to this Damascus to arrest Jesus follower. Suddenly a bright light surrounded him. He fell down. A voice said, So why you're so curly to me <coughs> So Saul was going to Damascus to arrest Jesus followers. But so many bright lights around the time and like said so why are you so cold to me? <coughs> you will be very afraid and like you will think he was dead. Who are you, Lord? Saul asked. The voice replied, I am Jesus, the one you want to harm. Go to Damascus. There you will learn what you must to do. So <coughs> Saul asked to the voice, Who are you, Lord? And Jesus replied, I am Jesus, that you don't like me. Are so curly to me. And Jesus told Saul to go to Damascus because that he will know what he must do. I found the Bible to him. Saul got up, but he was blind. His friends led him to a house in Damascus. Saul waited there for three days. He had nothing to eat or drink. So Saul got up, but he was blind. 
so his friends a lot of time to the house in Damascus. Yeah, also Saul didn't eat anything or drink for three days. Oh, yes. We have to do the question. Question that Jesus speak to Saul when he was on his way to arrest Jesus' followers. Yes, Jesus spoke to Saul that go to Damascus and you will know what you should do. Meanwhile, Jesus appeared in a vision to Ananias, one of his followers in Damascus. Jesus told him to visit Saul and pray for him so he could see again. So meanwhile, so Jesus appeared to Ananias, one of his disciples, follower. And you just tell them what the Saul is in Damascus and go and pray for him and so he could see again. He will not understand because Saul was going to harm his followers and disciples. But Saul wanted to overstart followers. Adamus was trembling. I know, said Jesus, but I want to use salt to tell people all over the world about me. <laughs> so, Ananias was confused because Jesus was saying to Ananias to... kill Saul because but Saul was going to arrest their followers and Jesus wanted Saul to, to tell people all over the world about me and then yes went to pray for Saul Jesus sent me he said so that you may see and be filled with the Holy Spirit. Saul could see again. Then he was baptized. So Ananias obeyed Jesus. So he have got to Saul and prayed for him. And he could now he can see again. Jesus wanted to use to tell people all over the world about him. Number two, so. And so was baptized. Jesus changed Saul from a man who hurt his followers to a church leader who told everyone about Jesus. So he changed his name as well to Paul. 
So also Saul changed his name to Saul, Paul, and Jesus changed Saul from a man who hurts his followers to a church leader. Saul's life was changed by Jesus, and his name was also changed to Paul. True. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did I enjoy? Then next time I will read another good story. The listeners. Bye.